Pinapadalahan na natin ng sulat si, sino ba ito? Ordinaryong tao ba yan? Bradimer Putin. Who is protein? Hindi, protein. Yan po. Si Putin. Siya po ang pinakamatalino at pinakamahusay, pinakamatapang na tao sa Russia. Ano sabi ni Putin? Lahat ng bibili ng diesel, gasolina sa amin sa Russia, hindi na namin tatanggapin kung wala kang backup na ginto o gold. Paano ngayon ang Pilipinas? Hindi nyo pa pinaupo ang taong may karapatan po merma para marinyo ang 239 countries na marinyo ang kanilang backup para makagawa ang mga currency. Eh ngayon, nirequest na ni Putin, wala ng bansa na bibili sa Russia ng gasolina at krudo na hindi backup ng ginto ang pera nila. Kasi ang pera sa Pilipinas, fiat money. Ano ba yung ibig sabihin, ano ibig sabihin ng fiat money? Play money. Ano siya bigyan ng play money? Walang value. Subukan mo dalin sa Hong Kong, sa Singapore, sa Japan, ibili mo yung pera dito, hindi kilala. Bakit? Kasi ang kanilang collateral ay ang mga Pilipino-Pilipina. Basahin yung inyong pera. Nakalagay doon. Ang salaping ito ay bayarin ng Banko Sintal ng Pilipinas at pinananagutan ng Republika ng Pilipinas. Sino ba yung Republika? Di ba tayo? Yan. Niluloko lang tayo. sa mga politiko-politiksan. Kaya dapat tiksan nyo. Uy, huwag na kayo kumandidato. Mahiya kayo. Hindi pa kayo qualified. Okay, so ito po. Yan, pinadadalhan natin ng sulat si Vladimir para diretso na na dito sa ating makipag-communicate. Kasi tayong pinakamayaman sa oil. Tayong pinakamayaman sa gasolina. Tayong pinakamayaman sa krudo. At nandito sa atin ng deuterium na walang iba. na pinakamayamang bansa sa buong mundo ang Pilipinas. Bakit naghihirap tayo? Bakit naghihirap kayo? Kayo ang may mali kasi binuto niyo mga tao, puro pangako. Pagkatapos na may upo, wala namang ginawa, kundi itaas ang milyar ng lupa, itaas ang tax, itaas ang bilihin, itaas ang gasolina, itaas lahat ng bayarin. Eh wala kang trabaho, paano ka? Yan, nauna ka namatay. May pananagutan ba sila? Natuwa din, nabawasan daw yung, nabawasan daw ang populasyon. Pero hindi totoo. Tayo ang pinakamayaman, tayo ang pinakamahirap. Ay magbago na kayo, gumising na kayo mga guys. Okay, nandito na sa atin ang tao mo bibigay ng solusyon. Okay, so ngayon na uh, darating na investiture, ito po yung ating gagawin. Ito po yun. Uh, pakipakita mo lang. Yan po. Tulungan nyo na ang inyong sarili. Tutok mo lang dyan sa may cross na kanyang uh, corona. Nakita mo? Okay. Yan, tutok mo, lapit mo. Yan po ang gagawin natin uh, ngayon darating na investiture niya o pagkukorona, pagpiging natin sa kanya. Yan po yon. Yan po ay naganap noong 1979. Tama ba? 79 ba? Ayan. Ulitin na po natin ngayon yan dahil andito po sa atin lahat ang court order ng Korte Suprema. na pinagbibingi-bingihan lang nitong mga nasa justices at lalo na si Jesmundo ngayon. Hindi nyo pa in-approve ang aming uh, establishment for uh, patrimony. I-approve nyo na. Pag hindi nyo i-approve, tatakbo na kami sa International Court Justice, International Criminal Court. Doon tayo ngayon maglalabo-labo. Bakit ayaw nyo paupuin yung taong may-ari ng bansa? Na nakikinabang naman kayo. Kayo yung na hawaan ng kagahamanan ng lagayan dito, lagayan doon, puro manitox, manitox. Okay, tama na, Karo. Okay? Yan po ang gagawin natin sa darating na investiture. Kaya ito po ang ating court order. Panahon ni Bersamen, 2019. Yan. Para mabasa nyo po, hindi tayo nagbibiro dito, yan, pinakikita ko sa inyo sa camera. Lahat po kayo na 112 million maharlika Pilipino-Pilipinang operyan. Yan po ang gagawin natin. Supreme Court order po yan, ha? Out of office. Yan, 2019. Ginawa po yan ni Tiborcio, Villamor, Marcos, Talano, Tagyan, Deport. 2019, dapat pinaupo nyo na siya, 2010. Mga walang hiya talaga to talaga, oh. Kaya siguro, Kung, kung may mga tao lang na talagang kaya, kaya lang 
hindi pwede. Inadaan talaga sa gera te Dwarduar eh. Kaya pag nagkagera na, yun ang malaki, pinakamalaking problema. Walang mabubuhay na tao. Pwede lang kung pupunta ka sa ilalim ng tubig. Hanggang mayroon siyang katataguan, magtatago eh, pero mamamatay din. Dahil ang gagamitin ngayon, hindi na barel, kundi biological weapon. Okay, siyang si Mr. Governor General. Governor General Tiburcio Villamor Marcos, si Mr. Governor General, bisita po natin siya ngayon, panauhin po natin siya. At ito pa po ang Supreme Court Order na ginawa sa, sa atin. Kailan to? 1977. Okay? Pakita mo yan para makita nila. At ito naman ang oath niya noong 1978. Ayan. 2019, 2078, uh, 1978, and uh, 1977. 16 court order po ito. With penalty. Ibalik na ang lupa, pera at ginto kay Tiborcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Deport. Nagmamatigas lang talaga kayong mga ahensya ng, mga ng ating uh, Republic of the Philippines. Kayo po ang nagpahirap sa amin. Kayo po ang pumapatay sa amin. Kayo po ang gumagawa ng coronavirus at vaccine na walang virus, walang, walang, uh, walang coronavirus. Ginagamit nyo lang po kami sa negosyo ninyo na walang puhunan. Okay. Kaya, sino man ang gustong uh, makipag-ayos. Guys, hindi kayo dapat matakot. Tama na, Karo. Maubos na tayo ng oras. Okay. Idaan mo lang para maayos natin. Ayan, o taking niya noong siya ay nandito noon, uh, 19... Uh, 1970 1974 Yan. Siya po ang uh, tinaguri ang Sultan. At uh, 2007. Yan 2007 po yan na nandito siya. At 'yun po ang, ang ginagawa niya pag nandito siya sa ating bansa. Pero pag nandito siya sa Buckingham Palace, nag-aaral po siya na nag-aaral. So ito naman po ang court order niya noong 1978. Ibilis mo lang pa ganyan. Kasi yung oras natin mauubos. Mapupunta lang dyan sa isang pages. ba? Diba? Okay? Kasi kailangan makilala nila. Kasi may mga baguhan, lalo na kahapon. Ang daming sharing kasi almost 3,000 ang nanonood. So alam nila na ngayon ay nandito tayo sa live. Ito po ang kanyang lisensya sa Pilipinas. Sa LTO po yan. Okay. Ito naman po ang kanyang postal ID, identity sa Aritaw, sa pati po ng uh, uh, Nobel Okay, ito po yun. So hindi po tayo nagbibiro dito. Kaya pag sinabi niyang gera, ayaw niyong maniwala, ayaw tulong ang sarili niyo, ayaw niyong i-upgrade, ay eh, parang uh, halaman lang yan. Pag nagtanim ka ng papaya, nagtanim ka ng sili, nagtanim ka ng abukado, mangga, ano man, kung hindi na bumunga, ano ba gagawin? Putulin at sunogin, sigaan. Yan lang po ang gagawin natin. Simple lang. Ito po yung uh, kanyang uh, baptismal. Yan po. Ipinakalak po dyan siya sa Kalamba, Laguna. At ito naman po ang kanyang live birth. Kaya pinakikita natin dahil ang daming taong hindi nakakakilala kay Tiburcio Villamor Marcos dahil 60 years na hindi po siya ipinakikilala, hindi po siya binigyan ng atensyon para po ang ating bansa ay siya ang may-ari. Nakita nyo ba? Nakalakasan ng kanyang tatang 1972. 21 years na mamanihala bilang strongman. Nakita nyo bang may Tiborcio Villamor Marcos na humingi ng posisyon sa kanyang pamamanihala? Wala dahil ang kanyang ama ay legal counsel lang po ng kanyang nanay, tatay, lola at lolo. Ito po yung kanilang pinirmahan. Pakita mo yung pinirmahan dyan sa mga naging presidente ng Republic of the Philippines. Ay, yung pages mo na. First pages mo na. Okay. Pakita mo. Kasi sabi ng iba, kami maniwala lang pag ginawa na ni Tiburcio Villamor Marcos na mamigay ng tigpa 5 billion. 
Maniniwala lang din kami kung ang buong kabite na ipamimigay na sa mga naniniwala. Eh, paano ko din kayo maniwala? Ah, di ba? So, wala kayo. Oh. Ngayon, kapag mayroon naman naniwala, nabigay, nabigay na namin ang buong kabite. Dahil ang buong kabite ay nasa 128,000 hectares, 777 hectares. Pag napamigay na namin yan sa mga taga-kabiting naniniwala, Lahat ng hindi naniniwala, sila ang pinakahuli. Ubusin muna namin ang 110 million bigyan. Pag natira pa kayong buhay, adi okay, pag hindi kayo natira ang buhay, goodbye. Ganyan lang ang buhay, di ba? Kasi kayo, lahat nahawaan na sa espiritu ni Lucifer. Nahawaan na sa espiritu ni Satanas. Nahawaan na sa espiritu ng Jablo. Kaya lahat mga demonyo, halos mga tao. Mabuti lang, Sarah, pagtalikod, sisiraan ka. Ganyan ang mga ugali, lalo na kayo mga tao, di na nga marunong magpasalamat, gumalang sa mga nakakatanda. Dahil nasira ang utak, ang kanilang mood, dahil sa cellphone. At tinan mo dyan, nandyan ang pinirmahan ni, uh, eh, ano mo, eh, bigyan mo ng atensyon. Oh, consent mo na, uh, okay? Focus mo na. Nandyan ang pinirmahan ng Republic of the Philippines Association Institution andyan ang pinirmahan ni Karo, doon na pumirma. Dumiretso ka na sa perma. Ayan. Pinirmahan ni Elpidio Quirino, President ng Republic of the Philippines. Pinirmahan ni Sir Rosminia sa administrator. Yan ang aking ka posisyon ngayon na binigay sa atin sa akin ni Tiboso Villamor Marcos uh, administrator ng whole archipelago. Okay. Ayaw nyo't gusto gusto nyo. Dadaan talaga kayo sa maayos. Kasi di ko talaga bibigyan pag di kayo dumansa. Magpataya na lang tayo. Yun ang diritsa ang pagkasa. Dahil ngayon may detreat na ako eh. Marami. Dito lang. May detreat na ako pare. So ngayon makita natin kung anong hatapang nila. ba? Diba? Oh, tapos na ako sa Mindanao eh. Dito naman tayo sa Luzon. Okay. Nakita nyo yan? 60 years. Pumerma ang kanyang tatang, pumerma ang kanyang lulut lula at ang kanyang mother. Ito ang kanyang mother. Ay, wala pala dito. Nawala. Natabunan, ano? Okay, 60 years. Mula noong 1950. 2010, tapos ng pangungupahan. Bakit ayaw niyo ibalik? Kayo mga opisyal ng Republic of the Philippine Association Institution. Lalo na kay Digong Duterte. Magkaibigan tayo pero iba ginagawa mo. ba? Diba? Pero darating tayo dyan. Malapit ka na. Malapit na malapit ka na. Mawala sa mundo. ba? Diba? So ito naman ang nasa Pasay. Pakisuyo, pakita mo lang. Hanggang limang pages yan. Yan ang korte. Ayun ang uh, judgment ng korte mula 1904, panahon pa ni Emilio Ginaldo. Hanggang sa panahon ngayon, hindi binibigyan ng malaking atensyon. Ayan, guys. Para makita nyo. Pagtataka siguro kayo, no? Dokto si Dr. Tamayo, bakit ipinapakita yung mga dokumento ni Tiborcio Villamor Marcos? Ayan ang mga magnanakaw, mga Rodriguez. Lahat ng magnanakaw na umaman. Nandyan lahat, tinalakay yan sa korte. At sila ngayon ang mamayagpag. Sila ngayon nakipagkunaib sa mga politika, politisyal, politiko. Nakikipagkunaib. Lagay dito, lagay doon, lagay dyan, lagay dito. Kaya ang LRA... Na, nagawa na lang lagayan ng pera. Mag, lalabas nga ng dokumento. Piki naman. Yan. Tingnan mo lang ha. Yung Okada. Napakalaking building. 18 hectares ang laki. Nung ilabas ang titulo, ginastuhan ng almost 4 billion. Nakasanla pa sa bangko ng 7 billion. Nung makita ko ang uh, kanilang uh, titulo, yun pala kansilado na. ba nakalun pa sa bangko, anong kalukuhan mayroon? May sindikatong bangko, may sindikatong LRA, may sindikatong RD. Dito lang sa atin sa Kabiti, sa Trece, andyan si Edgar Santos bumiperma. Wala na, dismiss na, picking abogado na, picking judge. Pinaalis na natin dyan, bumalik na naman ngayon. Dalawin natin sunod linggo. Kumustahin natin. Ayan, nakita nyo guys, andyan lahat yan. So ngayon, tayong lahat ay tagapagmana. Dahil sa sa court order na yan, ang unang binigyan, 1972 o 1949, one year lang si Tiborcio, nilagak sa kanyang pangalan ang buong Pilipinas binayaran ng malaking halaga para ipamana sa kanya. Pero hindi naintindihan ng mga tao. Patingin niyan. 
may papabasa lang ako dito. Paki, pakibasa anak. Yung page 9, manapin mo. Basahin mo. Yung page 9. Patunayan ko sa mga official ng Republic of the Philippine Association Institution na kayo nangungupahan lang. Dalawang bisis na kayo umupa mula 1898. 50 years, natapos 1948. Hindi kayo nagbayad, pinagkera, 1946. Ito na naman ngayon. Nangupahan na naman kayo, nangupahan na naman kayo, 1950, 60 years, natapos na, 2010, ayaw nyo pa rin ibalik kay Tiborsio. Anong gusto nyo? Gera talaga gusto nila. Wala tayong paggawa kung gera talaga. Okay, pakibasa mo. Ayan, 9. Cash voucher mark as Exhibit A-2 to A-19. As evidence of yearly payment of rental of the Republic of the Philippines to the landowner Don Esteban Benita Staliano and Gregorio Madrigal Acop, said documents were issued by the Office of the President in the year 1966 upon request of the Solicitor General and made as an integral part of the government's position paper. Okay, nakita nyo, guys, girls. Umuu pa lang. Mula 1898 hanggang 1948. Hindi kayo nagsipagbayad. 1950, umupa uli si Elpidio Quirino hanggang 2010. Hindi pa rin kayo nagbayad. Ano gagawin nyo? Ano gagawin natin? Si Tiborcio ba naningil sa inyo? Hindi. Kayo ba siningil namin na administrator? Hindi. Pero lak ang, ang lalakas ng mga loob nyo, magkatitulong kayo ng mga piki lahat. Almost 39 million Title issued, Republic of the Philippines, official, LRA, LRC, mga tourist tourist na yan, RD, puro piki lahat ang titulong inisyon nyo. Mamaya, basahin ko sa inyo, paano mapiki. Pakibasa mo yung page 52 ba yun? Ayan. Ayan, pabasa natin. During the Republic of the Philippines had committed stopple and had rebound to become not party in interest over the subject land in the presence of survivor ears. Occasionally, it must be oblique or reconveyance for all the lands under its custody as illegal detainees or in graceful sense as trustee, for which it requires reconveyance in favor of the principal trustor, as prescribed by the Civil Code of the Philippines. Second sentence of the said decision. It is a universal acceptance. The title of the land once registered under the Torrent system is sufficient notice to the whole world because such action is an action in REM. All concerns, including the national government and its agencies, should take notice of this rule that no one can plead by reasons of ignorance and registration. Let this decision with compromise agreement be enforced in joining all concerned private persons and government authorities, Herman specified in everybody, natural or juridical person, to observe and address this decision with compromise agreement, observing the, observing the imprescriptibility period clause of its execution and issuance of its original in duplicate copies of OCT 01-4, including its TCT number T-408 and TCT number T-498, and including the withdrawal of the deposited gold bullion from any government body within or without the archipelago, either a member of the United Nations or only League of Foreign Nations, federations, as long as within the bound and jurisdiction of International Court of Justice, to serve for the lawful in interest of the lawful beneficiaries of late Prince Julian Maclean Taliano and the whole Filipino people in general. Otherwise, anyone who devised this order shall be dealt accordingly with the fullest force of the law. So ordered by City, February 4, 1972. Maraming salamat. Nakita nyo? na judgment na ng Pasay Court mula noong 1904 natapos 1972, February 4. At ito'y ginawa ng gift of love para sa lahat ng Pilipino-Pilipina na pinahirapan ng mga opisyal ng Republic of the Philippine Association Institution na nangupahan lang kayo sa may-ari ng lupa na walang iba kundi si Prince Julian MacLeod Talano Tagyan III at itong nagmana ang kanyang apo na walang iba kundi si Highness Majesty 
Royal King Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Deport para maintindihan nyo ang ating ginagawa rito. Okay? So ngayon, pabasa natin ang titulo ng buong Luzon. Eto na. Okay, basa nyo. Wala rito. Republic of the Philippines Department of Justice, Land Registration Commission Register of Deeds for the Pasig Rizal, Original Transfer Certificate of Title Number T01-4, Office of the Escribana de Cabildo, Hacienda Islas de Pilipinas Archipelago, Province of Manila, Cadastral Act Number 2259 and Cadastral Survey Number 4720, Entered Pursuant of the Transfer Certificate of Title, A Portion of the Mother Title OC T01-4, At the office of the Escribana de Cabildo de Manila, the Hacienda Islas de Filipinas Archipelago, located at Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao, in North Borneo, consisting of 7,169 islands and islets. The Registration Book, Volume A-7, LRC Archive Number 571, entered pursuant to Decree Number 1143, Protocol of 01-4, by virtue of the Supreme Order of the Royal Crown of England, adopted by the Law of Treaties. The Declaration of Principles and State Policies by the Supreme Court of the Philippines, LRC Civil Case Number Three Nine Five Seven Dash P of the Republic Act Twenty Six, dated March Twenty Three, Nineteen Seventy Four, at the Court of Pasay Pasig Rizal. It is hereby granted the Titular Decree Number Zero One Two Two Zero One Triple A Dash A O, which was amended the Republic Act Number Five Four 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 Five Four Four Five and Five Four Four Six to Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Code DVM NSM Triple Six, the last successor year of Emperor Marcus Ulpius Trajanus, King Felipe the Second, King Ferdinand the Seven, Her Majesty Queen of Spain, Isabel the Second, King Carlos V, and Princess Inimisha Cruz Villamor Italiano Family Clan. The geographical technical description of Luzon areas under the Hacienda Islas de Filipinas Archipelago, which is consisting of 7,169 islands and islets. The El Banco Español Filipino de Isabel II, the World Bullion Bank with paid up capital of 5 trillion US dollars, and subsidiary the El Banco Español Filipino Offshore Capital, as banking unit the TVM LSM Triple Six, with paid up capital of 356 million US dollars, being an integral part of OCT 01-4. With PD number 1034 and 1035, CB circular number 343, 1326, and 6426. Geographical technical description 11 to 69 of Luzon areas. A parcel of lands covered by OCT 01-4. Located location all provinces of Abra, Apayao, Benguet, Ifugao, Kalinga, Mountain Province, Ilocos Norte, Ilocos Sur, La Union, Pangasinan, Batanes, Cagayan, Isabela, Nueva Vizcaya. Cabarukis, Province of Madila, Bulacan, Pampanga, Zambales, Tarlac, Morong, Lake Province, Mindoro, and Carilaya contain ng 31 million 804,624 hectares, more or less. Geographic coverage beginning at the point one is plan 11 to 69 in the islands of Luzon. Therefore, the Supreme Court order dated March 21, 1974, upon the submission report of the Blue Ribbon Committee, the National Bureau of Investigation (NBI), in accordance with LRC Civil Case Number Three Nine Five Seven Dash P, pursuant to the law of the Philippines that has been issued a string of subpoena duce stacum, issued by the Court of First Instance Branch Twenty Seven of Pasay in compliance to the motion of the Solicitor General regarding the certificate of the title covered TCT Zero One Dash Four. Furthermore, in accordance with LRC Civil Case Number Three Nine Five Seven Dash P, the Republic Twenty Six, upon the execution of the last will and testament, the deeds of adjudication, the proclamation of the give of love, mortis causa soi heredis agnit, known as a special provisional law of the international banking of bailment, the law of constitutional right and ownership in accordance of United Nations Article Two and Four of the Economic Social Order Ecosoc Art Fifty Five, Fifty Seven, and Sixty Three. Therefore. The above-mentioned declaration of ownership has no criminal origin, no lines and encumbrances, and was protected by the CCP securities. Done this 11th day of September 1979, signed by Fred Ruiz Castro, Chief Justice of the Supreme Court of the Philippines, Enrique Ayagana, Executive Judge of Pasay, Antonio M. Nobles, Commissioner, Law and Registration Commission. Guys, guys, sunugin man nila lahat ng taguan ng dokumento. Hindi pwede nilang masunog sa International Court of Justice. Hindi nila pwede masunog sa International Criminal Court. At lalong hindi nila masusunog sa taguan 
ng Bank International Settlement at lalong hindi nila masunog sa taguan ng United Nations ECOSOC at lalo na sa taguan sa Court of Geneva. Yan guys, doon natin nakukuha ito. Ito ang titulong pinanalo at binayaran ng 5 trillion 356 million US dollar ipamana lang kay Tiborcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Deport. 2005 pa lang nagpadala na kami ng mga sulat sa inyo na ibalik na pagdating ng 2010. Bakit hanggang ngayon laps na kayo ng 12 years? Bakit hindi nyo binabalik? Gusto nyo talaga gera, ano? Okay, pabasa natin ang Bisaya. Ito sa Bisaya. Luson yung binasa mo. Pakibasa. Republic of the Philippines Department of Justice. Land Registration Commission Registry of Deeds for the Pasig Rizal. Original Transfer Certificate of Title Number T01-4. Office of the Escribana de Cabildo Asyenda Islas de Filipinas, Archipelago. Province of Manila, Cadastral Act Number 2259 and Cadastral Survey Number 4720. The Visayas Area Geographical Technical Description owned by the Hacienda Islas de Filipinas Archipelago, consisting of 7,169 islands and islets. The El Banco Español de Isabel II as World Bank exporter of AU and other commodities with paid-up capital of 5 trillion US dollars and subsidiary the El Banco Español Filipino Offshore Capital as banking unit the TVM LSM Triple Six. With paid-up capital of 356 million US dollars, being an integral part of OCT 01-4, coded name of 01-AAA-AO, registered in the Nine World Bank in Seven IMF PD number 1034 and 1035, CB circular number 343-1326-6426, Visayas Areas Geographic Technical Description. Territorial coverage beginning at a point mark 1 as 11 to 69 in the islands of Palawan, Bicol, Visayas, and Peninsula with geographic position as follows. Areas of Visayas and provinces covered by OCT 01-4. Parcel of lands location as follows. Islands of Palawan, Bicol, Peninsula, Albay, Camarines. Cambosur con Norte, Masbate, Sorsogon, Visayas, Peninsula, Iloilo, Aklan, Romblon, Antique, Capiz del Romblon, Guimaras de Iloilo, Negros Occidental de Buglas, Negros Oriental, Siquijor, Bohol, Cebu, Leyte, Biliran, Leyte del Sur, Leyte del Norte, Kibabao del Samar. Kibabaw del Norte containing an area of 5,996,215 hectares more or less. Therefore, Pursuant to law of the Philippines has been issued the strength of Sabina Dusa Stacum, issued by the Court of First Instance, Branch 27, Pasay, in compliance to the motion of the Solicitor General regarding the authentication of original certificate of title OCT 01-4. Furthermore, in accordance with LRC Civil Case No. 3957-P, Republic Act 26, upon the execution of the last will and testament, deeds of adjudication, proclamation of give of love, The Mortis Causa Soy Heredes Agnit as a special proviso law of international banking law of bailment. The law of constitutional right of ownership, Article 426, 427, and 428. Covered by United Nations, Article 2 and 4 for the implementation of the world peace in accordance with ECOSOC, Article 55, 57, and 63. Therefore, further... The above stated declaration has no criminal origin, no lions and encumbrances, protected by the law of treaties, CCP securities, and global immunities, done this 11th day of September, the year of our Lord, 1979, signed by Frederick Luis Castro, Chief Justice, Supreme Court of the Philippines, Enrique A. Agana, Executive Judge of Pasay, Antonio M. Nobles, Commissioner of Land Registration Commission. Napakaliwana, guys. Mga taga-Supreme Court, mga taga-DOJ, mga naging presidente, mahihiya naman kayo, ibalik nyo na kay Tiborcio para mapapakinabangan namin mga mahirap ang aming ninanais. Hindi kami nangangaway. Paalala lang. Ibalik nyo na. Kasi sisingilin pa namin kayo sa 300 dodikal yun at yung 400,000 metric ton na pinambak up. Sana nyo nilagay, ninakaw nyo. Okay, eto, Bisaya. Kailatang mga taga-Bisaya, pagpunta namin dyan, 
Meron na kayong pera, meron pa kayong lupa. Magsaya kayo. Okay. Share nyo ang ating videos. Nasa 89, share nyo, palos nyo. Thank you. Eto, pabasa ko naman ang Mindanao. Okay. Bisayas, binayaran ng 5 trillion 356 millions. Ipamana lang kay Tiborcio Villamor Marcos at pinamana naman niya sa atin as gift of love. Okay, pakibasa. Republic of the Philippines Department of Justice, Land Registration Commission Register of Deeds for the Pasig Rizal, Original Transfer Certificate of Title Number T01-4, Office of the Escribana de Cabildo, Asyenda Islas de Filipinas, Archipelago, Province of Manila, Cadastral Act Number 2259 and Cadastral Survey Number 4720. The Mindanao Peninsula embracing the areas and provinces with geographical technical description owned by Hacienda Islas de Filipinas Archipelago, which consists of 7,169 islands and islets. The El Banco Español de Isabel II, the world exporter of AU and other commodities, is under the original certificate of title of OCT-01-4, under the code of flat-coran 01-AAA-AO, With paid up of five trillion US dollars and three hundred fifty-six million US dollars for El Banco Español Filipino Offshore Capital, the other codes of these assets are INA, MFCA-RP, ABA, WVM, CCD, MCD, JPR, are all under the code of L-50, the Long Loan Investment Program 5020. These were registered in the nine World Banks and seven IMF, Trilateral Society of Global Funder, matured August 11, 1985. And restructured January 2, 1986, and maturity 2009. The El Banco Español Filipino Offshore Capital take over by the virtue of Trilateral Act 61 and was protected by PD number 1034-1035 and 1143, with CB Circular number 343-6426 in the law of Jones R 211-259. Mindanao areas in North Borneo geographic technical description in territorial as follows. A parcel of islands located in Mindanao and North Borneo Peninsula, embracing the areas of Basilan, Zamboanga del Norte, Zamboanga del Sur, Bukidnon, Misamis, Camigen, Misamis Oriental, Misamis Oriental, Sultan Kudarat, Sultan Kudarat, Mindanao Sur, Mindanao Sur, Mindanao Sur, Davao del Norte, Davao Norte, Mindanao Sur, Mindanao Sur, Cotabato Sur, Cotabato Sur, Sarangani Sur, Surigao del Norte, Surigao del Sur. Tawi-Tawi, Turtle Islands, and North Borneo. Sabah, all consolidated areas of 88,518,786 hectares, more or less. Particularly prescribed in the geographic co coordinate as position described as follows. Beginning at a point marked as 11-69 in the islands. At geographical areas of 257 million... 749,014 square nautical miles of equivalent of 88,518,786 hectares more or less. Therefore, pursuant to the law of Philippines has been issued the strength of subpoena duces tacum, issued by the court of first in instance, branch 27 PASA in compliance to the motion of the Solicitor General regarding the authentic authenticity of the original certificate title of OCT-01-4. Furthermore, in accordance with LRC Civil Case Number Three Nine Five Seven Dash P, Republic Act Twenty Six, upon the execution of last will and testament and the deeds of adjudication, the proclamation of give of love, the mortis causa soi heredis agnit, as a special proviso law of constitutional right of ownership, Article Four Two Six, Four Two Seven, and Four Two Eight, covered by United Nations Charter Article Fifty Five, Fifty Seven, and Sixty Three. Therefore, further, the above stated declaration has no criminal origin, no lions and encumbrances, and was protected by the law of treaties and CCP securities and global immunities, done this 11th day of September in the year of our Lord, 1979. Signed by Fred Ruiz Castro, Chief Justice, Supreme Court of the Philippines, Enrique E. Gana, Executive Judge of Pasay, Antonio M. Nobleas, Commissioner, Land Registration Commission. Okay, so darinig nyo, ah. Mga guys, Mula sa presidente, kabinete, senador, congressman, gobernador o ng kabite, mayor at barangay captain. Maganda na kayo dahil ito na yung last din nyo. Okay. So ngayon, dito naman sa atin, pababasa ko itong uh, binigay na maliit man lang na katungkulan. Okay. Ano kaya itong katungkulan na ito? Pakibasa mo. 
Alpha Omega World Development Marshall Program United Nations H World Military Divine Government and the Universal Queen of Queens Foundation Bureau of Central Interpol General Power of Attorney Know all men by these presents IHRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort of Legal Age Filipino Resident of Comjan Hay Baga City Hub name Constituted and appointed Civilio Bitamayo Filipino of Legal Age with office address at Tamayos Agroveggie Products and Distribution Corporation, SMJJ Building, Salitran Road, Barang Barangay Salitran 2, Das Marinas, Cavite, Philippines. To be made true and lawful attorney in fact, for end in my name, place and deeds to be in perform the following acts and deeds to wit. That I, HRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort, is the sole signatory redeemer from the Code of King of Recognized Asset Nations, known as C1 C2 1921 Triple Seven, flat and trust account practically deposited all over the world maturity in the year 2006, Global Funder Titular Decree Number 01022740A. That I, HRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort, has a coded name of DVM LSM Triple Six, who is the new successor here of the real estate properties, the only torrent system title certificate in the Philippines, no other than OCT 01 4, as the mother title of the whole Filipino archipelago since the year 1761. In other asset commodities, the Constitution was approved and amended by the Supreme Court of the Philippines, adopting the proclamation Declaration of the Gift of Love by His Excellency President El Pijo Quirino. Confirmed by the Central Bank of the Philippines, protected by the lawfully registered Intrilateral Society Commission, under the law of international and recognized by 196 League of Nations. That I, TVM LSM Triple Six, being the last successor here, is the sole owner of 7,169 islands and islets all over the Philippine archipelago and other assets of the Royal Family Clan, which are equipped with 16 Supreme Court Order, which is kept in Archive Section 1972 to 1986. In accordance with Rule of Ownership section, section 6, the state shall promote social justice to ensure the dignity, welfare, and security to the people towards the end. That I, Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort, based on the Republic Act 26, TVMLSM Triple Six in the year 2005, I shall have full authority to move, remove any undertaking with discretionary power of the Code of Coran Cruz Villamor Taliano Family Clan Properties, assets deposited in trust by the trustees Old Gold Bullion, Al Banco Espanol Filipino de Isabel II, and Ascenda Isla de Filipina. That land grabbers in all squatting syndicate from local and national government in all subject areas and premises would be mandated to vacate and clear it early as possible. Otherwise, the court would not hesitate to implement the Embargo Act. That I am the chairman of Alpha Omega World Development Marshall Program as the institution of registered International Association of Security Dealers. Is the backbone of civilization of world economy today being designated implement of UN ECOSOC, Article 55, 56, 57 through my chairmanship. That the different Supreme Court order are as follows. Supreme Court order March 21, 1974. Ordering the settlement for all the real estate properties covered by OCT 01-4 and return precious metals and stone. The gold bullion managed by Central Bank of the Philippines after 50 years such gold reserve and trust could only be withdrawn by the last successor year. Supreme Court order August 11, 1976. Ordering all lands occupied by the government structure, either national or local purchase, including Saba North Borneo under OCT 01-4, in gold bullion metric tons and all asset commodities owned by El Banco Espanol Filipino Offshore Capital, will be returned to TVM LSM Triple Six. Supreme Court Order August 11, 1977. It states that the greatest land and gold robbers headed by ex-president Diosdado Macapagal, Secretary of Finance, Monetary Authority et al. had failed to debate entering with the last successor year Prince Julian Macle and Taliano. The first billion bank of the Philippines have 77 subsidiaries as HHBC. Banks in Hong Kong, etc. and all servicing prime banks refused to coordinate. Supreme Court Order August 4, 1978. The LRC Civil Case Number 997 of CFA Branch 26. Pasay City had incorporated the LRC Civil Case Number 3957. And after execution of such documents in accordance with Section 4, Republic Act 26, Tiburcio Villamor Marcos coded DVM LSM Triple Six is the absolute year successor, owner of all assets, commodities, large in trust in Central Bank of the Philippines, Land Bank of the Philippines, including foreign banks around the world, maturity 2005. That Ferdinand Erdogan Marcos Chua Tai Lee is my legal counsel. Likewise, 
I am the Global Founder Trilateral Co-Chairman of the Committee of 300, Member of G2023, H World LSM Alpha Omega, Member of Il Banco Español de Filipino de Isabel II, World Chairman of Alpha Omega Global Marshall Program, and Member of the National Security Council of United Nations. That Civilio B. Tamayo, my attorney, in fact, who is a Director General of Humanitarian United Nations, a five-star general Monday trustee United Nations League of Nations, ECOSOC will act as my representative with authority to transact in behalf of my negotiate, sell, dispose, leasing on lots, as well as buildings or establishment, either agricultural, residential, commercial, industrial, within the area of Cavite, a part of Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao, including Palawan and Borneo. That Sibilio Bitamayo, with the assistance of certain people, assigned by my attorney, in fact, to census, survey all properties, including Filipinos who have no properties, either agricultural or residential, in who lacks of financial, and act as my attorney, in fact, in the content of general notice to the public, wherein copy for niche was submitted to 33 regulatory body in 34 international communities who confirmed, signed, and, att and attested. That my attorney, in fact, has the authority to negotiate, sell, Lease, rent, file, deliver documents needed for the whole archipelago. That any collection or financial amount collected, I will get the 30%. In the 70%, my attorney, in fact, is responsible how they are going to use the 70% as follows. 30% to most people in the city with IDs of Alpha Omega. 30% for the development in the mountain where the people will do food plantation to be served to the cities and development of roads going to the area of the place where plantation is done. 10% for those who work in the plantation implementation of Alpha Omega, giving granting at the said authority in fact full necessary power and authority to do and perform in favor of me in every act and necessary to be done and about the requisite premises as fully to all interests and purposes present. In witness whereof, we have heard to set our hands in Das Marinas Cavite on this day of March 15, 2022, signed by HRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano to the Ford, Ear of Ascenda Islas of Filipinas Archipelago, signed by Civilio B. Tamayo, my attorney in fact. Yan guys, narinig nyo, nabasa nyo, clear. Wala ibang pagdadaanan. Dadaan talaga kayo kay Tiburcio Villamor Marcos. Wala po ding angkin-angkinan. Yung three, uh, 39 million title na inisyo ng Republic of the Philippines official na binuto-buto ninyo siyang nagpapahirap sa inyo dahil nauso ang money talks. Lagay dito, lagay doon. Paglabas naman ng titulo, peke at esporyos naman. Yan, guys, at sinasabi ko sa inyo. Kay Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao, hindi na dapat kayo, guys, mabahala. Dahil mayroon ng taong pinagkakatiwalaan na tutulong sa inyo Lahat ng walang lupa, bibigyan ng lupa. Lahat ng walang bahay, bibigyan ng bahay. Lahat ng walang pera, bibigyan ng pera. Pakibasa mo mo na ang personal na profile ni Tiborcio Villamor Marcos, Talano Tagyan Report. Okay, Alpha Omega World Development Marshall Program, the Universal Queen of Queens Foundation Incorporation, Bureau of Central Interpol, Personal Profile. His Royal Highness Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Taguinda Fort with coded name TVM LSM 666. He is the youngest son of former President of the Republic of the Philippines, Ferdinand E. Marcos, with, with the Princess of Spain, namely Princess Inimisha Cruzin Villamor Taguinda Taliano, who owns the global assets of the family clan under the code of Quran, TVM LSM 666. Since in the year 2010, he is the sole signatory from the Code of Quran, King of Recognized Asset Nations, known as C1, C2, 1921, seven flat and trust accounts, practically deposited all over the world maturity in the year of 2005. Global Founder Titular Degree Number 01022740A. He took his oath of office at the Supreme Court of the Philippines dated August 11, 1978 through Chief, uh, Chief Justice Frederick Castro. And on March 28, 2012, the Supreme Court of the Philippines invited him ag again to take his oath for the second time and was a officiated by Chief Justice Renato C. Corona, being a global founder and peace uh, peacekeeper for humanities. 
He is a former military man since 1978. And in the year 2007, according to the doctrine of his documents, he will be inheriting the position of a seven-star governor general of United Nations from Dwight Eisenhower, a former Supreme Commander General and President of United States of America. He took his first degree in economics and banking at Cambridge University, Europe, and has taken his master dissertation at Oxford University. He also took his political global governance at Broking Institute, uh, Institute, Washington, D.C. He has also a doctoral dissertation in canon law and in uh, initial laws of jurisprudence to among colleges and universities. And pursuant to Section 3 of Republic Act 26, the Philippines renounced war between the ownership of OCT T01-4 since 1904, ended 1914, and 1963, ended 1974. The government was lost upon the issuance of Sabina Juices Tacum, issued by the Court of First Instance of Rizal, 7th Judicial District, uh, 28 and Pasay City under civil case number 3957-P in compliance with the motion of the Office of the Solicitor General and the National Bureau of Investigation, NBI, over the authenticity of the Ear of Code of Quran, King of Recognized Asset Nations, TVM LSM 666, new successor Ear of the Real Estate Properties, the only torrent system title certificate in the Philippines, no other than OCT, uh, OCT, T, 01-4 as the mother title of the whole Philippine archipelago since the year 1764 and the other asset commodities the constitution was approved and amended by the Supreme Court of the Philippines adopting the proclamation declaration of the gift of love by His Excellency President Elpidio Quirino conformed by Central Bank Governor Honorable Miguel Cuaderno Sr. protected by Treaty of Perpetual. Okay, lawfully registered in Trilateral Society Commission under the law of international and recognized by the 196 League of Nations in order to give such person the last successor year, uh, HRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Taguinda Ford, codename TVM LSM 666, is the sole owner of 17, uh, 7,169 islands and islets all over the Philippine archipelago and other assets of the royal family clan, which are equipped with 16 Supreme Court orders kept in the archive since 1972 up to 1986. And in accordance with the rule of ownership section 6, the state shall promote social justice to ensure the dignity, welfare, and security of the people towards the ends, according to Republic Act 26 TVM LSM 666, in the year 2005, shall have full authority to move, remove any undertaking with discretionary power of the Code of Quran Cruz Villamor Taliano Family Clan, properties asset deposited in trust by the trustees, all gold bullion El Banco Espanol Filipina de Isabel II and Hacienda Istas Filipina, the land grabbers and all squatting syndicate from local and national government in the subject areas and premises would be mandated to vacate and implement such order. Nevertheless, the Embargo Act 1807 may be implemented in accordance with Charter to Charter of the United, uh, United Nations Article 2, International Court of Justice under Olmsted, US 277-US438, those who violated the mutual agreement is punishable in the International Court of Justice Paris and France, and subject for closure and operation Embargo Act 1807 under the banking law of bailment. Since 1950 establishment, the C1, C2, 1921, triple, uh, triple, seven, triple seven, and in 1971, proclamation of the decree 168 for ABL program, printed the Demonetize, demonetize Philippine currency notes inside and outside the Philippines where the group of the Board of Governor recognized by the Fund Committee by major international financing institution, system and the U.S. Treasury, the backup of set, set of ABL ang bagong lipunan of the Court of Pasay City, Philippines in accordance with Republic Act 26 only year 2000 to 2007 under the Law of Ownership Act Article 426, 427, and 428 shall adhere to the proper rules and regulation of the redemption under his code of 1738777 as embodied in the Certificate of 
entitlement with special trust depositor by virtue of declaration in trust agreement covered by global immunity and insured at Lloyd's of London Insurance, the right and duties of Baylor and Bailey. The Bailey must exercise care so as not to permit injury to or destruction of the properties of TVM LSM 666 by himself or third party after maturity date. The Bailey returned the property in good faith by virtue of the rule of trilateral society of global founder must disagree. The Article 61 may be Embargo Act 1807 shall be implemented implemented without court order the alpha omega world development marshall program as the institu institution has been registered to the national association for security dealers nasdaw amex it has been the backbone of civilization of the world economy today has designated to implement the un ecosoc article 55 5, 5, 6, and 57 through the chairmanship of hrh tiburcio villamor marcos taliano again the fourth Global founder with titular decree number 01022740A, Seven Star Governor General of International Security Council of United Nations. Signed by Director General Melvin Luis R. Uh, Uno, or Ono, Ministro de Communic Communicaciones, Adjutant General, Provost Marshal, code name MRO026, and General Dionisio V. Teng. Chief Political Advisor, Adjutant General, Provost Marshal Code, named DVT-003, and signed by Justado S. David, uh, Administrative Auditor, Adjutant General, and Provost Marshal Code, named DSD-228, and signed by General Raf Z. Valdosa, Embajador de Comunicaciones, Adjutant General, and Provost Marshal Code, named RZB-652, and signed by HRH Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagin the Fourth. So Redeemer of C1, C2, C19, 21777, Flat and Trust Accounts Globally. Successor year of OCT, T01 4, and TCT, T 408, and T 498, and Hacienda Filipina Archipelago, United Nations Seven Star Governor General, Quran Soul Signatory, code name TVM LSM 666, US Treasury IDIC 608-479. Titular decree number 01022740A, Federal Reserve System ID number C608479, Global Founder uh, Trilateral number 5432110110, Co-Chairman the Committee of 300 World Bank Group, Member G20-23, H World LSM Alpha Omega, Member of the Board Trilateral Commission, Chairman El Banco Español de Filipino de Isabel II, World Chairman Alpha Omega Global Marshall Program, Member the International Security Council of United Nations. Yan mga guys, mga girls. Yan ang kanyang uh, personal uh, profile. Nagtapos din siya sa pinakamataas na paralan sa buong mundo bilang canon law. Kaya hindi kami natatakot. Mag-ayos na tayo kung nais yung maayos. La tayong lahat na 112 million Pilipino, Pilipina, maharlikang operyans, native man kayo, kung ano man, porya lang sa mga banyaga, kayo ang tinaguri ang napakayaman sa buong mundo. Bakit iilan lang ang mayaman sa ating bansa? Dahil sa kamalian ninyo, buto kayo dito, buto kayo doon, ilik kayo dito, ilik kayo doon, yan ang nangyari. Itong mga inilik ninyo, mga politisyan, politiko, siyang nakipagkunayb sa mga banyagang namumunan dito at tayo ay pinabayaan. Nandyan tayo sa squatter, nandyan tayo sa kairapan, sila namamayag pag sa Makati, sa Daport at sa Pasig, malalaki ang mga tirahan nila. Kayo na bumuto sa kanila para asahang ibigay ang gusto ninyo, pinabayaan tayo. Uras na, gumising na, Mag-ayos na kayo. Tulungan niyo na inyong sarili. Bangon tayo, mga Pilipino, Pilipinang, malikang uferian. Yan ang ating kailangan dito. Hindi kami pwedeng umatras. Pinasubo niyo kami, itutuloy natin ang laban. Magkagira man ang Ted Dordwar. Tawagan natin si Putin. Tawagan natin si Jinping. Tawagan natin si Joe Biden. Tawagan natin ang presidente ng Africa at India. Lumusob na kay sa Pilinas. Tingnan, Pilipinas. Tingnan natin kung saan kayo pupunta. Okay, ito ang platform genuine ng ating Highness Majesty King Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Deport. Ito ang kanyang uh, platform. Please, listen. 
Meron tayong requirement sa banal na kasulatan. Nakaulat yan sa Apokalipsis 2.17. Ang lahat ng may pandinig ay makinig sa sinasabi ng Espiritu. Lahat ng magtatagumpay, bibigyan ka ng mana. Ngunit kung patigas-tigas ka, paalisin ka namin doon ka sa buwan tumira para walang problema. Okay? Maliwanag mga guys, mga girls? Okay, pakibasa mo. Yes. Genuine change to come. Our platform for the Filipino people to the world, the mission statement of Alpha Omega World Development Marshall Program, and the Universal of Queen of Queen Foundation. Number one, to implement the world peace economic stimulus backup, the global monetary systems of all central banks worldwide, and set on track the global e-currency reset. Number two, the Central Bank of the Philippines will serve as the Millennium Centurion, Gold Bullion Bank of the World Bank with the ancestral domain of OCT-01-4, the the Filipino Archipelago, and in conjunction with 13 Federal Reserve System Banks and Treasury Values of the United, Na United States of America. The Central Bank of the Philippines is the safekeeping bank of gold, diamonds, and platinum. Platinum. That's protected by the Treaty of Paris, Treaty of Versailles, 1928-1934, the Treaty of Amity of the Understanding in Concordance of Agreement in 1915, with the ministerial at the stations of League of Nations and the United Nations with all kind of gens, global economic trade zone. Focusing to the main problem of every Filipino by providing them such as free water, free public hospitalization, free education to all public schools, free seminars and training for the job employment, free electricity to all households, residential units except industrial plants, industrial parks, and other business purposes, to give jobs to all jobless, no age limit, to prioritize all widow and single parent providing them a job, no age limit, establish a comprehensive social welfare development fund with a budget of 5 million per Filipino, from the newly born to the oldest, massive housing projects to all squatter areas, to all homeless steadier, pabahay para sa lahat ng may hirap. Infrastructure development centered to the con construction of roads, railways, housing, public schools, malls, hotels, and major government energy, water communications, transport transportation, agriculture, etc. In the implementation of environmental planning waste management, water distillation for free, for free water, and utilization of all natural resources. Offer a range of outbreaks for the armed forces of the Philippines, Philippine National Police, military training and recruitment, hardware, contingency, and logistic. Maraming salamat. Kayo mga PNP, mga Air Force, Marines, Sundalo, mga NPA, magkaisa na kayo, magkaisa na tayo. Kasi wala naman kayo magagawa pag nagkagera na eh. Maniwala kayo. Hindi kayo kayang buhayin. Hindi kay bubuhayin sa biological weapon. Tandaan niyo yan. Nakahula na yan. Prepared na ang mga alien. Ang kasagutan lamang nito para hindi matuloy ang senaryong napakabigat para sa mga Pilipino, Pilipina. Tulungan niyo ang inyong sarili na madala na natin sa Central Bank. Si Tiborcio, Villamor, Marcos Talano, Tagyan Deport, at saka sa Palas sa Malacanang. Ito ang kanyang account, pakisoyo, para mabasa nila. Ayan ang kanyang account sa Bank of China na mayroong 2 quadrillion US dollar na nakapangalan sa kanya. Matured na yan noong 2007, November 1. Ang interest pa lang ng kanyang pera kapag nakaupo na siya mga guys, mga girls, kaya na nating igawa ng peso. Yung 410 trillion interest pa lang ng pera niya mula noong 1934 hanggang 2010. Ayan. Ito, pakipakita mo to Para maintindihan nila. Hindi lang tayo maka-withdraw ng pera dahil pinamumugaran ng maraming mga sindikato, maraming mga ulupong, maraming mga serpent, maraming mga buaya at maraming mga dragon dyan sa Central Bank na yan inasyum na nilang kanila. Uy, mahiya-ihiya kayo. Hindi naman kayo nakapagbibigay ng kalutasan ng problema sa mga Pilipino. Ito nga lang vaccine na ito eh. Puro lang kayo negosyo ng walang puhunan. Pinapatay nyo pa ang mga Pilipino-Pilipina. 
Ibalik na natin kay Tiborcio Villamor, Marcos Talano, Tagyan Deport. Bago mangyari. Bago mangyari ang senaryo. Ayan. Ayan. Kaya Justice uh, Gismondo, tatawagan kita mamaya, mag-uusap tayo. Total Bisaya ka rin naman o kaya ikaw ay uh, Panggalatok o Ilocano, mag-uusap tayo para maayos natin ang ating bansa. Okay, pakibasa. The last. Ito, pakibasa. Ang, uh, uh, kailan ito binigay? Kahapon lang to binigay. Birthday ko. Days of 75. Sabi ko nga eh, pare, uh, gusto ko nang magpahinga eh. Kasi ang laki ng inatas nyo sa akin. Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. 110 million Pilipino ang hirap imanis. Ang titigas ng mga ulo at puso at loob. Kabiti pa lang, naibigay na nga sa akin, pero ayaw maniwala. Ang titigas ng mga ulo, matatanda, mga bata, millennials, may sakit o wala. Ang titigas, nasanay sila sa kapapaniwala ng mga propaganda, ng mga politiko-politika na naghahari-harian, hindi naman sa kanila. Pakibasa mo ito. Alpha Omega Role Development Marshall Program. Age World United Nations, Philippine Military Divine Government, and the Universal Queen of Queens Foundation, Bureau of Central Interpol, General Power of Attorney. I, Tiburcio Villamor Marcos, as known as Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort, coded name TVMLSM666 with title decree 01022740A, King Fisher Harbor King Ina Dash Aba Dash Triple Seven Dash Triple A, MCD WMB CCD Philanthropies. 7 White Stallion SGDC 1C2 1921 7 Federal Serve ID number C608479 and US Treasure ID number 608479 Ancestral Domain Asienta Filipina Archipelago OCT 01-4 El Banco Español de Isabel II Certifies that I appointed General Civilio Tamayo Filipino citizen bearer of Philippine passport to undertake, negotiate, and represent me as my mandate director and appointed trustee for the Alpha Omega World Peace Economic Development Infrastructure Marshall Program in the United Nations Pentagon H World Military Program. I am here with giving full power of attorney. King Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Taliano Tagyan de Fort, coded name TVMLSM 666. United Nations Seven Star Governor General, Supreme Commander Allied and Non-Allied Nations, Sole Redeemer of Flat and Trust Accounts Globally C1, C2, C19, 21, Quran Sole Signatory, U U.S. Treasury ID, IC608479, Title Decree Number 01022740 Co-Chairman the Committee of 300, Federal Research System ID C608479, Global Fund Trilateral Number 5432110110. Member of G2023 H World LSM Alpha Omega. Successor of OCT 01 4, TCT T 408, and T 498. Member of the Board Trilateral Commission. Chairman of El Banco Español de Filipino de Isabel II. Judicial Administrator, Hacienda Filipina Archipelago, World Chairman of Alpha Omega Global Marshall Program, Member of the International Security Council of United Nations. Yan guys, mas lalong lumawak. Lumawak ang aking obligasyon. Pero di bali, ayawan ko man ito, nakakaya sa ating bisita at guest ngayon, na siyang may-ari ng ginto na 1,181,000,000 336,475 metric ton. Maliban pa dyan, ang nakadeposito sa China, hindi pa natin na rin nyo, 1,715,000 metric ton. At ang Amerika, naghihintay ang backup. Naghihintay ang backup ng China. Naghihintay ang backup ng India. Naghihintay ang backup ng Europa. Anong sabi ni Putin? Lahat ng walang backup na pera Piat money dollar, hindi na pwedeng bumili ng diesel at gasolina sa Russia. Tandaan yan. Kaya kailangan natin na maayos ang ating bansa dahil dito nag-ugat ang kayamanan. Dahil ang ating bansang OCT t 0 nandito lahat ng presyos, nandito lahat ng kayamanan, lahat ng klase ng diamond, lahat ng klase ng mga kayamanan ng mga herbal, Lahat ng kayamanan ng Joterium nandito sa atin at ginto. Tandaan niyan. 
Walang iba. Ipaagaw ba natin to sa Amerika? Ipaagaw ba natin sa China? Ipaagaw ba natin sa Japan? O ipaagaw ba natin sa Russia? Guys, girls, gumising na kayo. You 117, buhay na buhay kayong nanonood. Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. Sundalo man kayo o kaya kayo ay marins. O mga PNP police. O mga NPA. Ano mang klaseng buhay kayo na tao. Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. Sama kayo sa ating universo. Ito ang dokumento na nakapangalan mismo sa lolo ni Tiborcio Villamor Marcos. Pakisoyo. Roel. Yan. Tingnan nyo. Pakita ko sa inyo yan. Yan ang, tit uh, yan ang pinakaplano na nakuha sa pangalan ni Fris Julian Macleod Talano Tagyan Deport. 1898 pa yan. May piisyo na. Inagaw ni Emilio Aguinaldo. Inagaw ng mga sumusunod na mga administrator. Lalo na itong mga naging goberno dito sa, mas sa, sa Kabite. Masyadong mapusok. Ang mga taga-kabiting mahihirap, pinabayaan na nila. Pero sila yumamanday sa nakipagkunaib sa mga dayuhan at nilalakad ang mga lupang pagbalagyan ng, ng titulo sa Supreme Court, sa LRA, sa RD, sa LRC na mga picking dokumento. Yan ang nangyari sa atin. Katangahan na tunan niya. Heal the world. Ngayon po, nandito na ang gays. Dito lang tangi sa buong mundo. 229 countries. Hinahanap sa bilang Quran. King of Recognized Asset Nation. Walang iba. Ha? Highness. Royal blood. Majesty. King Tiborcio Villamor Marcos Talano Taggan Deport. Origin. From Alhambra, Spain, ang kanyang mother, ang kanyang mother from sa uh, England. Okay, pakinggan natin ang kanyang sasabihin. Pwede ka na magsalita, kamahalan. Magandang uh, hapon po sa lahat. Napakaganda po ngayon ang gusto kong sasabihin sa inyo. Dahil, ah, at bago sa lahat, ito pong inyong uh, kapatid, anak o ama, Tiburgio Velamor Marcos. Italiano, tagihan the fourth. Bagos, nandito po ako dahil nandito rin ang isa sa mga familia natin na ngayon ko siguro i-reveal kasi ang tunay na naipangalan sa kanya eh, ang pangalan talaga niya na talagang na-bless na sa Alpha Omega World uh, Peace Community Development uh, Marshall Program. Gusto kong tawagin ang aking uh, uh, isa sa uh, mga kapamilya natin. Ang pangalan po ay eh Marcos Ulpius, Aurelius, Bagos, may Marcos na naman. Italiano Tagyan, the second. Halika dito. Kasi talaga ipakilala kita. Yun ang mga pangalan ng Kingdom ng Maharlikan Operyan. Sa ilalim po sa pamumuno ni King Tiburcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Report. Ayan. Maraming salamat. Kaya tinawag ko siya, meron pating nagawa 
na talagang sing-sing na ng Alpha Omega World Peace Community Development Program na intended para sa kanya. Na may insignia na UMT, ibig sabihin, Ulpius Marcus Taliano Tagian II. Ibibigay ko po itong sing-sing sa kanya. Maraming salamat kamahalan sapagkat binigyan mo siya ng karapatan. Hindi na ako mahirapan. May kasama na akong magtatagumpay kami sa aming layunin sa pamimigay ng lupa, pera, sa lahat ng walang bahay. Bibigyan na natin sila. Basta iupo natin siya pagkatapos ng imbestitur, piging o sa ating koronasyon. Magsalita na ang kanyang binigyan ng malaking karangalan. Walang iba. All Pios, Trahanos, Marcos. Uh, talaga namang nagkakagulat ito, Chairman. <laughs> Dahil uh, supposedly sa atin lang muna sana yan. Dahil delikado tayo, baka ako mismo titirahin na naman. Dahil eh, italyano rin pala ito. <laughs> anyways, malaking responsibilidad. <laughs> anyways, ano ito, napakalaking, hindi natin masasabing karangalan or whatever dahil This is beyond this is beyond my imagination. Yung kinanta natin kahapon na impossible dream talagang yun na yun eh. Impossible dream. At saka ito ngayon kasama natin yung hari. So masasabi ko naman this is not just only a name but it is the responsibility to all the people of the world. Dahil Pangalang Taliano na pakabigat yan. Yun ang talagang may hawak. Imagine Taliano. Tinaguri ang King of Recognized Asset Nations. So, kung dala mong pangalan na ito, napakahirap. At saka napakabigat na responsibility. So, basta. Ako, ano mangyari? Nandyan ka naman eh. You have to protect your <laughs> yung mga tawad mo. Palagay <laughs> ko, tayo. <laughs> may price yung pangalan na yan. <laughs> yan na nga eh. Yan na nga. Napakabigat yan. Sobra so, na responsibilidad oh, yan. Oh. <laughs> so, so, ano, ano pa bang magawa natin? So, ganito na yun. We have to gagampanan na talaga natin ito. Saka, sana eh. Nandito naman yung ano natin, doktor natin. Whatever eventualities, ano mayayari? Hindi sana. Re. Hindi sana. Andito. Ta talaga. Andito. Oh. Pag nagpe-pray tayo, hindi mm. tayo pwedeng pababayaan mm. ng ating may likha ng langit at lupa. Hindi mm. tayo pwede pababayaan ng mga ilin na yan. Mm. Hindi tayo pababayaan ng Beringan City. Tandaan natin yan. Sige. Ang obligasyon ay obligasyon. Ang assignment ay assignment tanggapin. Kasi kung hindi tinanggap ni Noah ang kanyang assignment, wala tayo ngayon. Tama ba? Kung hindi rin tinanggap ni Tiborcio Villamor, Marcos Talano, Tagan Deport, isang taon pa lang siya, 1949, anong malay na siya ay italaga ng banal na espiritu para ipamana niya Mula sa Bangko Espanyol, ginawa ang Central Bank ng Quezon City at pinunduhan ng 400,000 metric ton na ginto para i-backup. At gayon din, pinunduhan ng 300 dodikalyon na pera para ayusin. Pero ngayon, ano ginawa? Yan, wala na yan. So ngayon na dito, bangon tayo muli. Ibangon ang katotohanan. Yan ang ating gagawin. So anyway doc anyway uh, nandito na naman ta uh, nandito na naman tayo we have to ano natin uh, 
ano natin, lubos-lubosin na natin dahil today mayroon din revelation na sasabihin si chairman sa atin. Eh, itong Sige. hawak niya na supposedly... Okay. Uh, uh, siguro uh, napaka-importante ito dahil ang hawak ko ngayon Makita niyo. Gagilak-gilak. Yan ay uh, core of arm o badge yes. ng isang templar. Templar? Ngayon. Ang hawak ko ngayon, pare. Ito ang badge ni Presidente Rodrigo Roa Duterte that has been assigned to him. Siguro, pag makita ninyo, eto po, ayan, tignan niyo yung numero Good. Nung, nung badge na ito. Na he's one, one of us na Templar. Para kay uh, President Rodrigo Duterte. Code number Dio Duterte. Yan. Dio Duterte. Dio Duterte. 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 Yun ang code talaga niya. Dio Duterte. Yan ang kanyang record. Oo. Mm. Alpha Omega. At nakalagay dito, ano ba yun na? Member of the International Security, Security Council. Council. United Nation. Ah, malaki ang... Bagos, pare, eto ang shield. Tayo lang makakaprotekta uh, sa kanya na hindi siya makakasuhan. Hmm. Tama. Sa buong mundo. In short, tayo lang. Hmm? Ha? Oh. Kasi kasama natin siya na Templar. And ito, Brother Digong, you are one of us. And this is your shield. Dio 30. 30. Dio 30. 30. Do 30. Ito ang shield niya sa kanyang sarili. Paki ayos mo. Yan, pakita mo kasi ibibigay natin sa kanya yan. I-award natin sa kanya. Yan. Lapit mo. Yan. Uh, Brother Digong. Yan, lapit mo. You are one of us. You are one of the Grand Templar. Yan ang magpo-protect sa kanya para wala siyang kaso, wala siyang problemahin sa International Court of Justice, International Criminal Court. Ligtas na ligtas ka, sifting sifting ka dyan. Yan. So nandito kami, brother, natagurian ka na ikaw daw ang sunog fire lalo na sa spiritual familia natin itong brother mo itubig kaya nandito ako para sa iyo maraming salamat sa ating ginawa ngayon na pag-award at pagbigay ng malaking atensyon kay Mr. Uh, Excellent Rodrigo Duterte, Administrator and President ng ating bansa. Uh, ilang buwan na lang, matatapos na kanyang term. Ito ang desisyon ng banal na espiritu sa pamagitan ni Tiborcio Villamor Marcos Talano Tagyan Deport. Bibigyan namin kay ng proteksyon para ikaw naman ay mabuhay at magkaroon pa ng extension. Nasa edad mo, magkaedad ka lang ng 300 years, di na masama. Di ba? O, ganyan kami rito. Dahil ang Tamayos Agro Bidji Product Distribution Corporation ay isa ito sa mga iniinom nyo 
sa pamamagitan ni Ambassador Gunit Gion ng United Nations na kabis sa London. At pari-pariho naman kayo nakatira at nakikita naman sila ni Mr. Gunit Gion, the Ambassador, sila ni uh, First Lady Hanilit at yan din po sa ilan sa mga kasamahan ninyo. Yan sa Ritz Tower. Kaya maraming salamat po at ito'y ipaparating natin kay uh, Excellent Rodrigo Duterte, Administrative and President, the Republic of the Philippines. Thank you so much. Maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat. Ito'y mga format ng Alpha Omega World Peace Development King of Recognized Associated Nations for Hong Kong Shanghai Incorporated. Sick number is, uh, ito'y nakaregistro sa SAC and National People Initiative Council Incorporated. Ito po yung maglalagay sa kanya sa Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao up to the Malacanang Palace at the Central Bank of the Philippines. 110 million Pilipino, Pilipina, mahalil kang offerian. Hindi ba kayo makagagawa ng paraan? Yan. Iilan lang ang mga tao nagpapayaman sa inyo. Nalamangan na kayo, hindi nyo pa naramdaman. Yan po, nakakalungkot man. Kasi lahat ngayon ng mga nasa karsada, tandaan nyo, uulitin ko na naman uli sa inyo. Uulitin ko na naman uli sa inyo. Ito. Itong ating gagawin. Alam nyo ba, mga guys, mga mga nakikinig ngayong hapon. Ulitin ko na naman. Ayan. Hawakan mo. Ito, guys. Tingnan nyo. Pakisuyo nga. Pakireflect. Pakireflect ka mo. Ayan. Tandaan nyo, guys. Lahat ng nangkandidato ngayon ng presidente, senador, congressman, at mayors, ipagpatuloy nila ang COVID at hindi nila ang titigilan sapagkat napakalaking pera ang awa-awa, awa-awa din naman na itutulong sa mga Pilipino at Pilipina. Diyan pa lang sa dita yan, October 5, 2021. 638,048,000,000 billion, billion. Isa lang yan sa mga date mula noong 2020, March 17. At almost nasa nasa 3 trillion na almost uh, sumobra pa. Yan guys, ang sasabihin ko sa inyo. At yan, hindi talaga sila titigil dahil nandyan ang pera na kalublub. At ito, ang mga mayors sa buong Pilipinas nakakawidro o nakakahiram o nakakakuha sila ng pera sa ating account sa World Bank Infinite Account. Lahat ng mayor, narilisan sila ng 1 trillion, 100, baba mo konti, pambihira ka naman. Hindi mo ba nakikita sa monitor? Ayan. Narilisan ng 1 trillion, 137 billion, 363 million in 212,000. Nakakalungkot man, pero ang mga mayor, walang na itutulong na marami sa mga mahirap sa kanilang mga nasasakupan. Ibi ng kapitan. Nakakalungkot man. Uulitin pa ba natin sa Duterte administration na yan ay tayo naman ay pahirapan another six years? Nakakalungkot man. Pero ito, sasabihin ko na sa inyo. Ang judicial, ang judiciary, ang ating Supreme Court, lahat ng korte, basta patungkol sa judicial, narilisan ng 119,927,904,000 budget mula sa World Bank. Sa ating pera yan. Sa ating backup na gold yan na binakap mula 1934 hanggang 2005-2010. Napakasarap ang negosyo ng mga naging administrito. Kaya maski mahirap at delikado ang, pag, ang pagkandidato Gusto nila yan kasi madali ang pera dyan. At hindi naman natutulungan ang mga tao sa ating bayan. 
Ayan ang totoo. Release yan. At ito pa, ang pinakamabigat. Ayan. World Bank, narilisan ang edukasyon. Ang edukasyon natin, guys, narilisan ng magkano narilis sa kanila. 2 trillion 620 billion 596,640 uh, million 640,000. Yan guys, ang katotohanan. Nandyan lahat yan. Even ang kanilang hugpong hugpong pagbabago narilisa ng 523 billion. Isang pizza lang yun. Mas marami pang pizza silang nakuha. Anong naitutulong nila nun? Wala. O, ba? Diba? So, ito pa ang pinakamabigat sa lahat. Ginamit ang ahinsya ng Republic of the Philippine Association Institution. Walang iba kundi ang DSWD. Isang pizza lang yan, guys. Narilisan sila. 5,787,363,000,000 pesos. Isang pizza lang yan, May 31, Sunday pa, tinago-tago pa date. Saan kayo lalagay niyan? Hindi lang yan ang release, guys. Ito pa. Development loan. Lahat ng pakarsada o kaya yung mga project natin sa agricultural para makapagtanim ang mga tao. Narilisan ng 5 trillion, 326 billion, 80 million ang narilis. Ayan. Isang pizza lang yan. Guys, andyan lahat yan. Saan na ang simpatiya? Saan na ang inyong konsensya? At itong pinaka itong pinaka mabigat sa lahat. Yan. Itong ating Meralco. Ang laki nang naririlis sa ating budget ang Meralco. Narilisan tayo ng taon-taon 18 trillion 279 billion 88 million 600 Uh, 618,081 peso in 80 centavos. Ah, ayan ha, talagang ano yan. Legit yan. Galing sa pundo ng pera ninyo natin sa ginto na binakap na ngayon sila sila lang nakakuha. Hindi naman tayo tinutulungan. Nadili ka lang konti sa meral ko, putol na agad. Yan guys, ang aking uh, sinasadya sa inyo. Okay, sino ba ang gusto nito? Papadala po natin sa ating uh, piin nyo lang ang inyong mga messenger. Padala po natin yan. Diyan kayo piperma. Diyan kayo piperma. Padala nyo dito every 5,000 na napermahan nyo dyan. Ayan. Pwede nyo ipa ipasirok yan para magkaroon tayo. O misis na kayo para isin namin sa inyo ipasirok nyo. Maraming salamat guys na natili ang 83 na mga nanood ngayong hapon saan man kayo naroroon. Maraming salamat.